Hello everyone, Little Four Smith here. It is Wednesday 19th of April 2023, so let's do a um, Encyclopedia Dramatica reading. So this one's going to be of KSI, which I have absolutely zero idea who he is, but he's apparently a twat on the internet, basically a um, black gate pool. Um, and he fought him like once and he made a really shit energy drink which all the children love for some reason even though it's like piss water I heard so yeah we're going to be reading up on um, KSI KSI is a famous YouTuber not to be confused with re retracted jinx uh, because all niggas look alike <laughs> he is well known for trying too hard to be funny by blurting out random shit to appear to to appeal to children who enjoy other content such as Damn, Daniel or anything else that spawned from the hell that is Vine. Wait, d did he start off on Vine? He probably did know him. Many of KSI's videos entail him being a major faggot while enforcing many nigger stereotypes. His content being as shitty as YouTube pranks. Oh, yeah, that is fucking shit, the YouTube pranks. I'm glad it. I'm glad YouTube pranking is like mostly dead at the minute. However, this is expected from someone who uploads once every day, as after a while a few clues like him run out of original and funny content, or had never had any to begin with, and they start shitting out videos for the lols and money. His, ske his schemes work as he gathered 12 million 16 year old kills who believes in the gr great black dick hoax and the 13 and 13 year, year old boy wiggers who thinks they are the shit. Truthfully they're not. You're, I mean to be fair you got to be a loser to watch the, to watch the fucking shit by influencers like him at the minute. He, he's not even a fucking influencer. I, d I don't know what he is. Career and life. Did he just fall from the sky? Probably. And that was a kink and or respectable individual responding to the nigger lord in one of his videos. KSI or oh, fuck knows what that means. I would love for short. Is born in Britain. May or may not be true. He's black. <laughs> to be fair, yeah, I do think he's actually born uh, like he he he's he lives in London. He's probably born there because he's like y young enough to be born over here. Come on now. <clears throat> in the sewers with his other brother, Dicky, also known as Ca Comedy Shorts Gamer. Um, to be fair, I might do a reading on on Dicky because um that's his like. Obviously, yes, yeah, his brother. I don't know if it's any good or not. I'm not, I'm not quite sure. I'll probably read up on him. The lesser of two evils in the aspects of joining sub count and mental capacity. Cap cap <laughs> capability. There we go. Their mother, who was raped by an alien. Fucking hell, this is brutal. Ripped, ripped them with electrical cords as met many times, causing the two to be altered forever. They mutated into a rare breed of mega version, currently not named not named with a goal to seek attention at all costs. Other individuals suffering from this con condition are Keemstar and Nico Arba. Isn't Nico Arba that fat girl? I'm not sure. Okay, so then created bad videos including many about the sin known as FIFA. Which should not be confused with FIFA World Cup, which is significant, which is slightly more significant. He gathered the cult following of little childrens. Wow, your Gmail settings is out of date. I know. I don't even use the um, email app on here. I just go to the actual website. It hasn't popped up in a long time. Where am I? Um. I forgot where I was. Uh, little children and other standard niggers and began to spread like the Ebola virus in Africa. That's fucking racist. <laughs> Possibly KSI's two birthplace. KSI's, KSI's content slash career, as stated before, is largely based ab about around, around his Asperger's and trying to say random shit 
full of lulls. However, he doesn't realise how unfunny he is, ca causing him to produce many anti-lulls. He also has titles in all caps. I fucking hate when YouTube titles are in all caps. It's so annoying. To increase quick clickbait. Much like other tumours, Leafy is here and Pyrocynical, Sakhalevi is here's autistic cousin. And to be fair, like I think Pyrocynical is actually quite pretty good. He doesn't really upload as much anymore, but he's, he's still alright. I quite, quite, quite like his content, says the almost 35-year-old man. <laughs> this lol random c comedy caused many degenerates from various social media sites to flock to his channel to amass him in large amount of views, money and subscribers. KSI, the filthy goo nigger he is, is pleased with, his, with this outcome and began slowly to make shittier and shittier content and began to engage in the great depth dep known as YouTube drama. He also makes music, but no one gives a shit because it all sucks. Mm. To be fair, yeah, he he, did, he does live in London. I think he's actually got a decent house as well. I'm not quite sure. I don't think. To be fair, like I said, I, I don't watch the guy. I've, I've, this is like me first learning about him in like a parody way. So, yeah. YouTube's drama. See, KSI is seeing a new trend to talk about. To talk about the large amounts of drama started by Markiplier, decided to hop along with PewDiePie and Matthew Santoro, all of them most likely to tw most likely trying to make money doing these filthy jewels. I ironically enough, KSI was creative, and instead of blabbering and contradict co and contradicting himself like a total fucking dumbass, uh, let me just check my um. Yeah, it's fine. It's, it's still recording. He decided to talk about the people who talk about YouTube drama. In the process, t talking about and giving more exposure uh, to him and the very thing he was criticising others for talking about. This caused, this caused a huge chain of fucktards seeking money and attention to talk about to talk talk about talking about YouTube drama and talk and talk about. T and talk about the people talking about drama and so on. In the end, he this resolved nothing, and it was all a big scheme by everyone who participated in it to get the subscribers that they definitely desperately need. Crave for survival, thanks KSI. In other words, he started all. Holy shit, KSI is a pedophile. Um, you got some. We'll, we'll read these tweets because this is a pretty short article. And this is some tweets that he put like 13th of May. I don't know when this was. And I would get actually should I um Okay, I've got to read it from like the um, bottom up. I have a fetish for young younger people. Uh so like sisters of my friends, so Harry's sister, Cal's sister, it's fucked up, but it's who I am. I would get would get into a lot of trouble if I came out and said I was dating a fifteen year old. I really just like her. Well, to be fair, you're publishing that on a public platform, so of course you'll get into fucking trouble. It's for a small video. It'll make sense on Kellogg's video. Yo, guys, relax. I know if there's this memeing ish. Oh, never mind. It's just a prank. Okay, but he ain't a pedophile then. Never mind. <laughs> Explain. Breaking the news. Drama and nation. KSI finally came out came out that he was a sick fuck like it wasn't obvious expecting ex expecting to the internets to think it, it, it was lulzy and he wanted to fuck a kid however to avoid get, getting party vanned he later tried to cover his ass by saying it was all for a video and bribing his friends by, give, by giving suck, sucking his dick so he'd do a video to explain everything this deferred to va party van, but like all niggas, it's probably end up in jail. So yeah, we do not know for certain what happens with that. KSI versus Rucka Rucka Alley. One day, KSI became came across the legend, the legend who got and got super offended because the song he saw was about nigger stereotypes. All of them are true. 
Then he sent an army to try and put an end to the lulls that he did not like. He then made a diss track, sounds familiar, on Rucker, so he could prove to himself that he really toasted him and hurt his feelings. And said he provided even more that he's not funny and gets offended easily. Oh yeah, that's another thing. Um, like Gate Paul and Logan Paul and all them other fucking twats, this guy liked to make diss tracks on people. Yeah, to be fair, if you make a dick diss track on someone then you're a really shitty singer. KSI and Guglon Daniel. KSI met a snow digger at a FIFA convention and asked to make a video of him to promote his once amazing channel. Guglon once came to visit him frequently stealing his money and cucking his mum. After using KSI he was butt hurt after he he was in interviewed saying KSI is a big dirty nigger. Oh my god what a legend. KSI rage quit on twi Twitter causing retarded drama because he got played nigger. KSI re re retaliated um, by making his loyal fans unsubscribe from the Google kid. Google didn't care because he made money already and already fucked off the, the college. Google was on a roll until he sent out a video apologising to him and no one heard of him since last Thursday. This is an old article by the way. I'll um, show you the, um, the, um, um, the date on it in a minute. KSI sometimes... Co oh, okay, I forgot to read the title. KSI is an adult film star and neo-Nazi. KSI sometimes called the man with the massively small dick and the black neo-Nazi became has become a porn star. <clears throat> he mainly posts work on Pornhub in the, in the event. He likes to be penetrated so <laughs> fucking hell. So so high so his dick becomes white. KSI and his brother, Dicky, would rape each other in the butthole. Then they would go and suck each other off in addition to becoming a porn star. KSI is also a neo Nazi. Can a black person be a neo Nazi? Probably. I just need to shave their head and that's it. Although some people Although some people may that KS, KSI is, is black means that he, he cannot be a neo-Nazi. It's fit, simply false. He is part of a rare breed of neo-Nazis sometimes called slave niggers. This rare breed lo loves black Hitler <laughs> and wants to control the world. Rappers such as Kendrick Lamar and Gay Z has even embraced this new form of Nazism. Slowly it's becoming mainstream and, mo and most and like and uh, and most likely it will fade away b because more and more blacks who believe in this movement keep put, being put into cages, thus diminishing their influence. See also, Comedy Shorts gamer, his autistic brother, Chris Hansen, his arch nemesis, paedophile, what he is, Keemstar, his love interest, and Wigglers, his fans. Links, his YouTube, his Twitter, his brother's YouTube, his Spotify. KSI is a part of a series on YouTube. KSI, KSI is a part of a se series of topics related to black people. KSI is a part of a series on cloud abuse. And um, yeah, this page was last edited on the 20th of July 2021. Um, that's why, because when I went on to this, which I really wanted to like read it for, because um, I really thought the, um, his new bit of drama um, come out, um, he got a show, um, no, I saw a clip on it, he, he, he got a show called The Sidemen and um, he was on a um, like a mock panel of Countdown and there was like, with, with, with Countdown it's basically you got um, 30 seconds to rearrange a panel of letters and make a word out of it to get more points. And this one, all the letters were there, and he says, "Oh, this is gonna be this. This is gonna be spicy. This is probably gonna gonna get him in in a bit of trouble." And he ended up saying "Packy," which is like a racist term for like um Indians and um like Muslims and that. So he he got into a lot of shit for that. Um, he did make a shitty apology video, but to be fair, that kind of made it a bit worse because. If if you do something like that, then you just gotta lay low. Don't 
like apologize for it make don't make a public apology because it's, it's it's only going to make it worse for himself and i got no idea like what he's up to at the minute but that was like a few weeks ago like a month ago or something so yeah i thought that would be on here but this is a like two year old article um it hasn't been updated since and i don't think it ever will be um so yeah th that that was it for the ksi article if you enjoyed this video don't forget to like and subscribe i really appreciate it um if you want to help support the channel you can donate to my paypal and coffee account um links are on screen all the time and i will see you guys next time